What's up guys, BBWiz, OldSchoolStereo.com. Today we're gonna to do a test some of you guys have asked about before. Big D, how does wattage output to speakers compare to the amp dyno? Well, we've got an Orion 225 HCCA second gen, the digital reference. We're gonna try it. Two ohms mono going to subwoofers versus two ohms mono going to the amp dyno. Stay tuned, let's see how it does. All right guys, here I have the Orion 225HCCA hooked up to uh, two sets of four ohm speakers. I have the four ohm Infinity VQ subwoofer and also the Rockford Power uh, 812s. Those are eight ohm speakers wired in parallel, so it gives the four ohms plus four ohms is a two ohm mono load on this amp. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna try out, first we're gonna try it with the AMM1 uh, go into the speakers and then I'm going to hook it up to the amp dyno at the 2 ohm mono load and we're going to see what the difference is. I always get a lot of people ask, hey, you know, what's the difference between real speakers versus resistive load? So let's find out. All right, 2 ohm mono load going to the subs. Let's see what it does. Two hundred and seventy-five watts, two ohms mono. That's pretty good. And again, that's a reactive load going to subwoofers. All right, guys, I've got the two twenty-five HCCA hooked up to the uh, subwoofers again. That's a two ohm nominal subwoofer load. So we're going to see what the AMM one says it is at forty hertz. So with the box rise. So right around 2.5 ohms. So let's try it on the dyno and see what it does at two ohms mono. All right, here we have the second gen Orion 225 HCCA. This time we have it hooked up to the dyno. We're gonna try the two ohm mono run at 40 hertz. Compare it to what we got with, with hooking it up to speakers. See what we get. All right, not too far apart. We got 292 watts at 13.6 volts. All right guys, there you have the comparison, amp dyno versus real speakers. In this case, the Orion 225 HCCA wasn't a whole lot of difference at two ohms mono between the two. I know you guys are probably saying, what about one ohm mono? What about half an ohm mono? Well, I didn't have the speaker loads to hook up today to try that, but I'll do that again in the future. Stay tuned if you wanna see the full amp dyno test. I know there's been a lot of, uh, I've talked a lot about doing this before for the 225 HCCA and I haven't really done a video about it. So stay tuned and I'll show that in an upcoming show in the future if you want me to. Give me a thumbs up, make sure you like, subscribe, share with your friends, Show to your mama. Tell them how great Big D's videos are. Until next time, I'm out of here! Thanks to Stinger Electronics for providing the accessories that power the OSS Labs. Find out more, stingerelectronics.com.